Hey, welcome back. Your time is 723 on Fox 59 Money Matters. This morning we're back with some more scams to watch out for on your next vacation. And it seems that scammers like to go after potential victims staying in hotels. And that's exactly what these do. Zach Myers joins us now with two vacation scams we should all know about. Zach, good morning. That's right, guys. Yeah, the scammers are finding new ways to disrupt your vacation if they can. When you're on vacation in your hotel room, you got to eat, right? Well, the scammers know that. One scam that's been working for years involves bad guys walking through hotels, slipping flyers under the door, for a nearby pizza place or a fake room service menu. Why would you question that, right? So when you call the number, they'll take your order and your credit card information, but there's no pizza place or room service, just a crook who's going to use that credit card information as fast as they can before you suddenly realize, hey, where's my pizza anyway? The experts at Scam Aside say a good rule to follow is just never trust a flyer under your door. You can also Google the name of the pizza place and see if it's real and if the phone number matches. As for room service, well, you should be able to call them with the button on your room phone, not a flyer slid under your door. Here's another one you don't want to sleep on, literally. Say it's 3 a.m. You're in a deep sleep in your hotel and the front desk calls your room phone. They say, we're sorry, we've had a problem with your room reservation and payment we need to run your card again. Would you grab your wallet, half asleep, and read them the information? Or snap out of your days and realize it's a scammer calling your room from outside the building? This one's called the fake front desk scam, and it's just another way for crooks to trick you into reading your credit card information over the phone. They're hoping to catch you half asleep. According to the watchdogs at Trend Micro, the best way to handle that call is to hang up and just call the front desk back. There's a good bet they won't know what you're talking about. Or you can say that you'll come down to the front desk at a reasonable hour and handle it in person, then hang up. I've got more on these and other vacation scams attached to this story at fox59.com. Guys, don't fall for them. The, f the flyer under the door thing, though, I mean, that could, That's crazy. you know, if it looks real, yeah, yeah. pizza sounds good, right? Great. Zach, thanks for that.